Hey folks, this is Grimwit from NatchEvil.com and we're gonna go on a little adventure. Oh, that mouse followed me. Oh shit! What in the heck? Creeper? There's a creeper there? What the heck? This never happened before? Where are you, creeper? Ah, no. ah there you are! Woo! Ha! <laughs> Alright, welcome to the land of Atrium. Yes, this is this entire map is the land of Atrium. From here to here, roughly. I have built a pretty profitable mine underneath. I have like 31 diamond from this mine. Now there's a couple of rituals I've placed in this particular world. The first being is every time I die, I still lay, leave a grave. But this time. Each time I die, I have a new name. This is Atrum, the founder. This is Benu, who was trying to fill up this map and actually succeeded. This is uh, Kazar, which died trying to rescue all of the stuff from Benu. He was right there, lost in a corpse run. And this is Dagon. Now, Dagon has his own city, the Unburnable so-called because he's dropped into lava multiple times and has not burned. Eventually, though, the lava claimed him. Um, you may have already seen this in the Chuck and Mike adventures earlier. Boy, I don't remember showing Chuck, at least, was that I do have a Hall of Records explaining all of the exploits of different people. This is the time of Benu. This right over here is the time of Dagon. And Dagon was around for a long while, so he got two walls worth of stuff. And right now, I am Ed the Axe. Alright, well that said, let's go ahead and show you the city of Dagon. Let's see, I got enough time. Let's jump down here. Yeah! Uh, uh. Okay, that hurt. Shut up, Cal. <laughs> Ed the Axe has his own country called Kick Axia. But it's still in the beginning. The beginning works of it. Lava! I told you guys I wouldn't do a Minecraft video for a while. I'll tell you a little secret. I'm addicted to Minecraft! Seriously, I have Minecraft dreams. I have Minecraft paraphernalia. Over here is a Minecraft pumpkin. Minecraft! Uh, this trail over here leads to this tent, which I'll be honest looks a little bit better in the regular texture pack, but that's okay. Anything in here? No. There he is. There's one of them. Get him! Ha ha ha! Ah ah ah! Uh oh. It's coming dark. That's okay, we're right at the entrance. For me, I have some health drink. See? Health drink. I didn't do that during the uh, 404 challenge. Now... Ooh, 
it looks like this looks like a good spot. empty rooms and this wall needs to be filled with something but I at least have a fishing lake over here where I can fish in my lake all right so we see all right let's go I'm gonna take the exit into the uh, muck desert we're gonna head north, and then we're gonna head. Well, I'm sorry, we're gonna head east, and then we're gonna head south to kick Axia. Oh shit! I have to fall on this one, don't I? Really, we should make this less dangerous. Got my guns. Guns. Only one thing will make this thing better. Guns! Okay, I don't see any bad guys. So, alright. That's east. We head that way, Kimosabi. Yes, there's the marker. These red markers denote the end of a country. This, for example, is the end of Atrium. Atrium country limits. So, over here is Kick Axia. Kick 
Axia is still uh, still very um, young, so there's still much to be done. There's always monsters spawning down here for some reason. Monsters this time? No? How boring. Alright, well that does it for this tour. thought I'd just update you guys. Also, um, yeah, yeah, starting tomorrow, we'll, uh, we'll return back to the wonderful, um, exploits of X Beyond the Frontier. See you then.